Yes, sir. Good morning. I am Paul Coleman. I serve as President and Chief Executive Officer of Mary Haven. Mary Haven is Central Ohio's oldest and most comprehensive provider of behavioral health care with a specialization in addiction recovery. Mary Haven and other behavioral health care providers have seen gambling disorders in our patients for the past several years, and we naturally expect an increase when casino gambling begins in our community. But there were no programs in Central Ohio to help men and women who have problems with gambling until three years ago. Mary Haven three years ago received a $25,000 grant from the Columbus Foundation to begin services to problem gamblers. It was a one year only grant. At the end of that period, we went to Orman Hall, director of ODATIS, and we said, can you help keep it going? And he said, yes. And ODATIS has been funding our program for the past two years. The incidence and prevalence of problem gambling is significantly higher among people with addictive illness than with the general population. Some research shows that problem gambling affects around 3 to 5 percent of the adult population, but the co-occurrence among people with addictive illness can be as high as 9 to 30 percent. So as I say, we've been seeing this for some time. 75 percent of the patients we've seen at Mary Haven have problems with something that's not up here. Internet gambling. Recognize that this is a big problem in our community. Um, the rest, mainly the lottery, about 10% even now with casino gambling because we see patients from all over Ohio. We've seen patients from Dayton and Troy, for example. In terms of the scope of the problem, according to a study by community research partners here in Columbus, the Columbus Casino could result in an additional 22,000 people becoming problem gamblers. That's why the framers of this amendment wisely set aside the 2% that Commissioner Davidson talked about in a fund to provide treatment services. That leads me to conclude by talking about compulsive and problem gambling. Mary Haven's position on casino gambling is the same as our position on the consumption of beverage alcohol. The vast majority of people can engage in both activities when there are not, without any problem whatsoever. But when there are problems, Mary Haven and other ODATA certified agencies are here to help. Thank you very much. It's now my pleasure to introduce 